I'm going to show you how to graph a polar graph using Maple, which is a computer algebra system. Now when I clicked on the Maple icon, which was on the desktop, this is what came up. And so now I'm going to show you what to do next. So I think it's a little confusing. First of all, you have to select a uh, worksheet. So you go to File, New, Worksheet Mode. And now at this point, you can either type things in in math notation or in text notation. Now I prefer this one, so I'm going to use that one. And now what I have to do is I have to type in the correct uh, syntax for it to graph the polar curve. Now this is what we type in. I want to graph the, uh, the polar curve r equal to 1 plus 2 sine of 5 theta over 2. Now I'm going to write t instead of theta because I don't know how to write theta in maple. So then I have 1 plus 2 times sine of this stuff. Now the thing you need to notice is you've got to be sure to put a little star here so that you tell maple that you want to multiply the 2 by this thing here. If you don't do that, it'll give you an error. It won't know what to do. And similarly here, I have 5t divided by 2. You notice I have 5 times t divided by 2. Then I put a comma, and t is 0 up to 12 pi. And notice how we do the pi, capital P I. And then comma, and then chords equal polar. That tells you it's going to be a polar graph. And notice there's a semicolon here. You put that there, and then you place your cursor after it and press Enter. And that gives you the polar graph.